Here I will show you how to use the query command on our link CAD file. Here I have selected level 2 CAD file probably, which is linked into our program. As you can see, once you click it and select the CAD file, the query commands up. So this is, can only be used in the link CAD or imported CAD file. Select query and then select on the object you want to show the properties or find the properties this will show you the layer and the property names this can be useful once you must to switch off or switch on or hide some of the layers or fixtures that you do not want to show in your drawing here we select the table and the layer name is A700 MFLE1. Let's go to manage, manage me, and go to CAD formats and then let's here we cannot use because we're using the view template. Let's go to the view template which is the architecture program. Let's select so it's PG override input. Here you will have the list of the CAD files. Let's select level 2. And from here you can see the list of the layers. Here we're looking for A700. So select the three items. Apply and then click OK. You can see the fixture and the tables are already off. You can turn it on again. Let's go to architectural plan and select the VJ overrides for input. Go to level two. And let's check that or turn on the layers. Now you can see that all the furnitures are already shown on the link card file. So this is how to use the query command to find the properties and the layers of the important or link card file in the Revit model. Here we try again and select some other furnitures. So it's the same layer. This is the link card file name click OK and then select press escape to escape the query command select and then again select another uh, furniture so that is how to use the query command thank you